The Maryland State Board of Elections said it fixed a glitch that took its voter system offline for a brief period on Tuesday, June 5, the last day to register to vote in Maryland's primaries. File Think Stock Gaithersburg, MD, the race for the Democratic nod for county executive in Montgomery County remains too close to call. It's a razor-thin election, said Jim Shalek, president of the Montgomery County Board of Elections. On Friday, the first batch of absentee ballots received by June 21 were counted at the Bow office in Gaithersburg. When the day concluded, County Councilman Mark Elric led businessman David Blair by only 149 votes. So far in the race, 124,000 votes have been counted. Elric has 36,117 votes compared to Blair's 35,968. In the race, while there is not a total for absentee and provisional ballots cast, the Bo said 14,902 absentee and 3,614 provisional ballots were issued. The old phrase, every vote counts, certainly applies here, Shalek said. On Thursday, provisional ballots will be examined and, if deemed valid, counted by the Bo. Of the provisional ballots received, some will come from the pool of 80,000 voters whose records were not updated by the Motor Vehicle Administration due to a computer issue announced shortly before the primary. The impacted voters had updated their addresses and party affiliation shortly before the primary. On Friday, all absentee ballots received by 10 a.m. that were postmarked by primary day will be counted. Shalek said the extra time is given because the county has voters sending in ballots from all across the globe. We've received absentee ballots from France, Spain, Israel, to my recollection, he said. The counting process, which takes place on Thursday and Friday, is open to the public. Those who would like to observe the 15 bipartisan teams as they go through the ballots can do so at the Board of Elections office at 18,753 N. Frederick Avenue. If you want to see what democracy looks like, come to the Board of Elections and watch these citizens work hard to make sure that every vote counts and that we count every vote. Shalek said. Like WTOP on Facebook and follow it top on Twitter to engage in conversation about this article and others. Copyright 2018 WTOP. All rights reserved. This website is not intended for users located within the European Economic Area.